studies and compositions are perhaps the peak of beauty in chess. When a wonderful, precise, almost magical sequence happens in the game, we say it is study-like, so perfect, with only one way to achieve the goal. They are also very instructive, showing in the purest form the possibilities of the chessboard and the powers of every piece and every pawn. I want to share a few of my personal favorites. I have to say it's not easy because I have so many of them. Uh, let's uh, look at a couple of uh, great studies with sacrifices and uh, domination and other key themes from um, another grandmaster, grandmaster of studies, one of the best in the world, Oleg Pervakov. Uh, not very realistic, I, 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 uh, I get it. It's white to move, so that's why just we have to advance our pawn, just, you know, queen. Black, queen is the battery. So we take it. Now, if black takes you, we have a knight and four check. So it's the four, queen, the queen, and this pawn decides. But black has a hidden defense. That's what's good about modern studies is that it's not, it's not a one-way street. There's always something that the other side, typically it's black uh, in, in the studies, um, has to offer. So the hidden defenses, rook g2 check, king stage g2, and now king h4 check. 